Hey Libra, thank you for tuning in. Uh, please take whatever resonates and leave whatever don't. Let's see what's going on for you, Libra. Show us a message for Libra. Libra, what is Libra message for this upcoming week, Spirit? Let's see. Libra. Libra. Let's get two more. Libra. 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 Let's get one more for Libra. Libra. Okay. Alright, Libra. We have gold digger. Yes, divorce. Someone else is in the middle. Someone, I mean, someone is in the middle trying to sabotage this. Okay. So it could be a third party here. Um, they want your money. You're being used or, yep. Or, I don't know, is this you, Libra? Take it high, very resonate. But we got experience in a breakup or a divorce. Let's see more for Libra. So be careful, Libra. Someone is trying to use you or is using you. Show us more on Gold Digger. Show us more on Gold Digger. Gold Digger for Libra. Show us more on Gold Digger. It could be a fire sign, an Aries Leo, Sagittarius, Sagittarius more. Um, yeah, whoever this is, they're very bold with it too. It ain't, it don't, it's not like they hiding it. They like, give me some money. Like, this person is bold with it. Like, they, they ain't even trying to butter you up and make you feel good <laughs> to make you want to give them. They just like, uh, I mean, they probably do you good, though. A lot of passion here with the Knight of Wands. They in and out. It's, this is, there's no consistency with this energy. It's just, you know, one minute they talking to you, next minute they not, and one minute they, you know, with you, you spend time with you, and then they're not. Like, some, something something is off here. The energy is, is letting you know. You peeped it. You recognize, like, man, I just got played. Yeah, this person playing the heck out of you. Okay. But you gonna have the last laugh. I, I guarantee you that. Show us more on a, um, we said, I mean, we got yes. Yes, luck is on your side, Libra. So, yeah, exactly, because you're going to have the last laugh. Show us more on this yes for Libra. Exactly, you're going to have the last laugh. You are. you coming out strong because you're strong-minded. You're like, oh, okay, I see the truth. This is you seeking the truth. You know you gain the truth. You already gained the truth. You see the clear. You, th you see right through it. You're like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. You're very, very fair. You make wise decisions. But when it's, I don't know, this person is, they could have been very, very manipulative. But also the passion was there. Ooh, why I say it like that? The passion. <laughs> the passion was there, Libra. I don't know. They, they did you good. This could have been someone you had a sexual partnership with. and Or it, we do have breakup or divorce. So you could have been in a relationship with this person. Or even married to this person. But you said, no, I, I, I'm i taking charge now. So you tired of this person playing on your top? Show us more on divorce. Show us more on divorce. Someone is a player. Divorce. It was destined to be divorced. Like, it was destined to be. This divorce is destined. This breakup or divorce is destined to happen. So they want you to go with the flow. Don't try to stop or go against it. Just go with the flow. Because it's meant, it's, de it's destined to be. That's <laughs> crazy. The Will of Fortune came out on the divorce. It's destined for this to happen. Okay? You, the, you're at a turning point in your life. And it's time for you to see and, you know, see, see, see go forward. So you can see this change that's trying to come in for you. Mm-hmm. Time to put this to rest. It's time to put this to rest. Show us more. Because someone was a player, player, all about the money and what you can give to them. That's why they was with you for so long or whatever. 
Show us more on the Knight of Wands. Show us more on the Knight of Wands for Libra. Let's clarify this Knight of Wands on this Gold Digger energy. Gold Digger came out in Virgo reading. You could have been dealing with a Virgo. Show us more on the Knight of Wands. Show us more on the Knight of Wands. Knight of Swords. Oh, yeah. They sh mm. Not only this player, player. This player, player. Not the Knight of Wands or the Knight of Swords. This person could have been very aggressive. Like I said, like they didn't have no no type of charm on it. No no wooing you. Oh baby, baby. They like, look, give me I need some money. You gonna you gonna give me some money? Like soon as you as soon as they lay the pipe on you or whatever, the, or you the one laying the pipe, however. <laughs> so what is like, all right, where my money at? <laughs> Maybe they're not saying it that harsh, but they aggressive with what they want. And they're going to speak on what they want. They're not holding back. They're not trying to beat around the bush and, like, get you to guess. or No, they like, yeah, you know, that bill, I, I, I need that money for that bill, you know. All right, can you pay this for me? They're going to tell they going to actually say, <laughs> dang, they ain't holding no, they ain't holding back. Show us more on the King of Swords. Um, yes, they like, yes, yeah, speak up, speak up now. Don't hold back, don't hold your tongue. Say how you feel. You feel like this person using you, say it. You using me, and I'm not dealing with this no more. Period. Show us more. They said, they said, speak up. Seven of Pentacles, three of Wands. Did that mean to come out, sir? Let me make sure. If it did, it'll come back out. Show us more on the King of Swords. King of Swords. Because it did just fall out of my hands. Alright, King of Swords. Page of Pentacles. Yeah, they could. Yeah. Tell them like it is. Like, man, this is. Look, I'm, I'm a very grateful person. But when I look back on this, look, you done, you done mapped it out. You done figured it out. You done weighed out the pros and cons. And you're like, wait a minute. You've really been giving me hardly nothing. This little baby chump change, all, all the, and, you, and it's not about you giving this person more, but it's like after so long, you're starting to realize, like, wait a minute, it's really no balance. I'm really not getting, I'm giving more of myself than you're giving to me. So this is you realizing this, and you laying down a law, okay? <laughs> they say, yes, yes, do that, okay, do that. Something could be significant about a child, a daughter in particular, All right, show us more on the Wheel of Fortune for Libra. Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, invest in this change, okay? Some of you have a change coming in. Invest in this change because it's time for this to happen. For some of you, it's time to let go of someone because you got another connection that you're supposed to come into. You could be coming into a connection with the fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. For some of you, someone could be... Uh, mm, Some of you, you could be reconciling with this person. Or they want to. Yeah, I feel like this person is wanting to reconcile with you. They want to continue to invest in you. Why? Because they're the gold digger. They're, <laughs> they're the one on the receiving end, constantly receiving. So, yeah, they want to reconcile. They don't want you to go. They're not about to find no. They're not about to find no one like you, Libra. You are the best thing they ever had. So, yeah, they want to reconcile. They want to heal this. Well, baby, baby, don't go. <laughs> don't go. Let's see more on this energy spirit for Libra. It could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Heavy on a um, Sagittarius, Gemini, uh, Taurus, Virgo. Show us a message. Or uh, yeah, I said Sagittarius. Show us more on this energy for Libra. Also, I'm getting like if someone, someone could have been, okay. On another note, y'all. The third party, someone with this, someone trying to sabotage this. This could be someone's baby mother that was in a mix trying to get in between. Because this, this is like the child, the child here and the money. 
Like someone was trying to come in and just all they want is money. They need money. They need this. They need that. They need this. They need that. Material things, finances. Yeah, that could have been the energy of someone who they already broke it off with this person, but they keep trying to stay relevant with finances. Yeah, and someone is, is more eager with fix, fixing it with you. So that is another situation for a slim amount of you. But um, let's see more on this energy for Libra. Libra. Some of you, it's your own child. Just a gold digger. That all they want is money or they want something from you. Show us a message for Libra. Libra. The snake. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious. Look over your shoulder, the other woman. So, yeah, it's definitely a third party that could be trying to interfere with this connection. Trying to keep someone, it's trying to stay in somebody's pockets. Karmic relationship, that's what it is. Fleeting triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go, and loving you. Show us more. For some of you, this is a... It's two scenarios I'm getting. The first one that I mentioned and the second one. So the karmic relationship could be the third party. Okay? And a karmic relationship could be the person that you're dealing with. That's what it's saying. Uh, resentment lessons. Letting go and loving you. Split up, break up, divorce. Show us more on this energy for Libra. Yeah, Stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, flexibility. Yeah, someone see you as security. Someone see you as security. That's what it is. They see someone as security here. And that's why they, they want to stay in this situation. Um, being charmed or use enable boundaries. Meeting and conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted, friendship. Someone could be dealing with a narcissist. Well, we have the end. End is bring new beginnings, growth, change, liberation, transition. Some of you, you could be in a twin flame connection. Once this is ended with whoever this third party is interfering with the connection, your twin flame, the passion is going to get ignited. So things is going to get heated up. But it's just a situation here that's getting in the way. For some of you, it's just this gold digger partner that you have. It's time to let him go. Okay? They are definitely just trying to break your pockets. It's all about what you can give to them, the stability, the security that they have with you. They don't find that nowhere else. They don't. It's not easily found, at least not for this person. So, tell them to go get it on their own. Like what? But that is it, Libra. That's all I have. Please take whatever resonates. Leave whatever don't. Um, for those who are new, I am a psychic medium. Um, I do live readings in TikTok now. I used to do it here in YouTube. I now do it in TikTok. So follow me in TikTok. Um, I do it a little different over there. It's actually pretty cool. You can definitely watch me um, or get a question answer as well over there. Uh, it's a link in the description of this video where all locations um, is listed. Um, it's one link. It says be is be my fan, but when you click on it, it's gonna have all the locations: TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, my psychic medium site, YouTube, all that is there. My booking site as well. Um, if it's not located in the description of this video, I'm going to make sure I do that. Make sure it's there. But if not, if you look and you don't see it, you can always go to my Instagram, Smell of Roses of Shun, and it's in my bio. All right. But until next time, you guys, many blessings.